and then we'll be good to go. So it's kind of... Good morning, everyone. It is Friday. Um, let me just put this down. I was doing some chores in the morning just to get it over with. I made some breakfast. I left some for my mom so she can eat whenever she gets home from work. Have my cup of coffee. I was supposed to go to the gym in the morning. Uh, Joanne and I, my boyfriend, we have been thinking of going to the gym in the mornings at 7, but that really doesn't happen. We just wake up super late and he just, you know, stays late stays up late doing homework so i don't know maybe we'll go in the afternoon but today i am trying to be as productive as possible i'm trying to get some homework done i really want to edit a video today and be able to have it upload today or tomorrow on my youtube channel so hopefully by the time you're watching it it's up and i have homework to do i'm actually going to edit the video because i need that done asap i procrastinate so bad some people do ask me how i edit my videos I edit them on my phone because the laptop that I have it is just a plain Jane MacBook Air she can't support any video editing because if not it sounds like George Bush Airport like it heats up it's crazy whenever I got this laptop I only had it in mind for just doing homework for college and then as I started doing more and more YouTube videos I realized that this laptop is useless for it so yeah I've just been editing on my phone and the app that I use is InShot you can use iMovie also it's great but yeah so word of advice looking for try to find a good laptop for editing videos because this one isn't it I look ugly, but that's okay. Uh, I finished editing my video. It, look what procrastination makes you do. I held off editing this video this whole entire time, like about a week, because I just don't want to deal with it, and it took me less than an hour. <sighs> Let me show you the app that I use. This is just the downloading process. It takes a little while, mm, like 20 minutes, 15 around there so now that i'm done with this i'm gonna help my mom do something and then i'm gonna have to do the two dumb quizzes for my classes so yeah i'll keep you guys updated for now while this is downloading i'm just gonna watch a youtube video i finally got this ring light in the mail a company reached out to me and asked if i wanted a ring light try it out for you all and be able to leave a review for them so let's go ahead and unbox it i the ring light that i have right now my boyfriend gave it to me for christmas so so thankful so this is the actual ring light the box is really huge compared to what is inside i'll make sure to recycle the box guys this one is bigger i think this is a 19 inch and from what i know the one that i have is like a 16 i could be wrong but we'll see so it comes with a plastic bag say hello to baby so it's nice that it comes with a bag just in case if you're a photographer or if you're out shooting somewhere else this is a nice way to take it along with you so this one is definitely way way bigger excuse me sir uh, this, these are the legs and i think you have to flip it over this looks very similar like the one that I have, there you go. What I like about this one, it has rubber at the bottom, so it doesn't slide. It's really nice and steady. The one that I have, it doesn't have that. It just slides around, which is sometimes annoying. This is the very top, can y'all see? So that's all the way it goes, which really great. Now let's go ahead and set up the ring light. You have to pop them a little bit. So this is what's on the inside, you know, those regular, uh, LED band strips. I was able to set up the ring light. It wasn't too difficult since I kind of know how to set it up. It just has the cord connected these two and then I just had to connect the mount. I really like this one. Well, I hope it works better because this one is not like the expandable ones, the one that stretch. This one is more, um, let me show you. The only way to expand is doing this 
which makes me feel more secure that my phone is not gonna slip off. So if you wanna move over the camera, do it like that. I think that is really good. I appreciate that. In the back, you have the option of putting two lithium batteries. Um, I don't, they didn't provide any batteries, so I hope it just works fine with the connection. As you can see, there is also a little USB part, just in case my phone dies. Like for example, right now it is like 20%. I won't have a problem because I can just connect the charger here and charge my phone at the same time filming. So that's awesome. This is just a dial plus negative. I believe that's just how strong you want the light to be. This is the on and off button, but okay, let's just go ahead and turn it on. Let's see how it works. Ooh. I'm using right now the ring light that I just got. This is like the lowest that you can get. Let me turn it all the way. Oh. So this one is bright, really bright. I think actually brighter than the other one, but um, so this is the brightest it goes and it does illuminate really well. It's more wider, so it grabs more of me actually. This is nothing. This is like the size of my head compared to that one that you saw. So I like that one. I believe this might be for an iPad um, if you record with your iPad or a tablet. So in the middle of the knob, there is a button, which I didn't even realize it was a button. I thought it was just a circular knob, but you click on it. So once you click on it, you use the same dial and you switch. So this is all the way white. Really bright. Move it, move it, it turns warmer, warmer, warmer until it's basically orange. And once you find the temperature you like, uh, you click it again. And now it would just adjust the brightness. This is why you read the manual. I don't want to give you guys any false reviews. Some things look flimsy, but overall it's a really good ring light for the price is really great. You can find it at Amazon, I believe also Amazon Prime. So if you're interested, I will go ahead and put the link in my description below. So let's get back to the video. 59 minutes left and this is just uploading. I have to wait for it to process. Like this is only the reason why I hate editing and uploading videos because it just takes so long. And I changed glasses because I can't find my other ones. I had to put them on because my eyes were hurting so bad. I just uploaded an Instagram story and I was wondering why were my eyes hurting so bad. Like I was getting a small headache but it was because I didn't have my glasses on. I'm just gonna let the video upload. And while that's happening, I'm going to try to do something else. Um, probably going to play with baby outside. Okay. Baby, do you want to go outside? Do you want to go outside? Let's go outside. <laughs> Drop the banana. Uh, I suck at keeping you guys updated on what I did, but last time you saw me, I went to the gym, did a workout. It was great. I love leg day. It just feels really productive. Ew, what do I have in my car? Oh my god, it's those ugly bugs. Look, they invaded the tail light. What the fuck? Ew, but anyways, like I said, 
I got home from the gym and I really enjoy leg day. You probably can't see anything. Uh, I'm sweaty. I am so sorry, guys. I enjoy leg day because it just feels way like it's it feels good that like it makes the trip to the gym worth it because I'm sweating. I'm tired. I feel like punching my boyfriend, but I am home. I made some food it's like breakfast, but it's already 1230. I'm outside with baby and I made some breakfast. I think it's migas, you could say, because I use uh, tortilla. I toasted some tortilla with, and I added, there's a plain. Excuse me, I'm vlogging. Now I'm just outside with baby, taking him so he can do his business. And I threw in my gym clothes. I need a shower. I feel so icky. But yeah, that's all that I'm doing right now. And baby is doing his business, so I'll catch you guys later. So the evolution of what you create together continues to be new all the time. Um, to serve the need. Good morning, everyone. It is Tuesday. It is Tuesday. And I have class i actually have a presentation just very thankful for the group that i have like they're all girls girl power and we're just all hard working like we each are doing what we're supposed to do i love them and i just made a coffee today's actually national coffee day took a shower and i believe my class starts at 10 it's 9 45 mm, i haven't eaten yet so i don't know i'll probably wait but I can just turn off my camera and I can make food. I'll probably do that. For the second group to present, each group has 15 minutes, so it's not that long, thankfully. So it's not gonna be all crazy. And we're each gonna wear like a red shirt, just to match. Two little buddies just popped up today and I'm not gonna pop them. What I did was I put some of this uh, drying lotion from the brand Rosen or Rosin Skincare. And it's white. It has tea tree oil, I believe, and zinc. And then, because it easily just crumbles off, I just put two acne stickers so it can really help stay in place and dry it up. But those are the only two that I received today. Acne is fun. Yeah, it is a chilly morning. It's 64. <gasps> but, you know, here in Texas and Houston especially, just temperatures go up and down, so I can't get too excited. i just wearing a red red shirt sweatpants and crocs speaking of crocs the new um collaboration between bad bunny and crocs eee, it's gonna launch today at 11 12 eastern but 11 here so i'm gonna get me some for sure i'm gonna try to get a pair for me and my boyfriend anyways let me just go ahead and finish getting ready my hair is super wet so i'll be right back we'll be with the mission statement being posted in we just finished our presentation and it went pretty well excuse my dog is barking i had to take my acne stickers off because like you can see the big white dots let me go see what he's barking at i don't know what he was barking at but this is the culprit baby what do you have to say for yourself exactly the rest of the class is doing presentations i'm gonna make some breakfast so i'm not that hungry yet and i have a baguette we bought some bread so i'm gonna attempt to make bruschetta i don't even know i'm saying it right bruschetta but we're gonna do that so we gotta hit the bread i'm gonna slice it diagonally with a bread knife we're gonna take out this little ugly corner put my hair up because i cannot deal with having a hair down while i cook my hair just like i don't know my hair might just like go in the food but it requires tomatoes we have roma tomatoes just like the video so we're gonna use them now the next step is to get some basil luckily we have been growing basil in our house it grows really quickly and spreads everywhere so we're gonna head towards the garden and maybe once they get out come put it thing Oh my god. 
and we're gonna get some basil so this is our little plant i don't know how much it requires but i'll get a good amount probably just get four because i also have a can of pesto which i think might give it more flavor but oh my god it smells amazing how i love it the things that earth offers baby vamonos come on Okay guys, so I minced the garlic, I added some salt and pepper, now a little bit of olive oil. I have no idea how much. That's enough. Now, I don't have any grated Parmesan cheese, but I have this powder, so I'm just gonna sprinkle some in and call it a day. Y'all probably can't see me, I'm sorry. And I also don't have balsamic vinegar because we, we don't buy balsamic vinegar. So, that's it for the recipe, I guess you just... Boop, 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 mix, mix, mix. But no agarré nada. The Crocs sold out, like, that's some bullshit. They probably had two pairs of Crocs because nobody, I've seen nobody got them. Crocs, I'm freaking come for you. So, I'm gonna go outside, listen to Drake and cry. This, can y'all see me? And this is the concoction that I made. Probably not. What's it called again? Prosciutto. Put it on top. So it says to chill it for an hour, but girl, my stomach is not waiting another hour. It looks plain and boring, honestly. It's just bread and tomato. Uh, let's give it a taste. Cheers. Let's act like if we're in brunch. Nothing special. Just toast and tomatoes. Um, this really isn't a meal. It's getting ready for a meal. So let's add a fried egg on top. Grab some of these sprouts. Tastes like plain grass, honestly. So I'm just gonna. Oh wow, that's five stars right there. Five star dining. Honestly, you can add a little bit of grass to anything and it looks fancy as Probably gonna ruin it, but I need some protein, so. Oh, you can't see anything. They're gonna get messy because it is a runny yolk. Uh, yeah, let's try it. The sprouts ruined it. I just taste grass. Okay. So I'm just gonna finish eating this. I'm gonna watch Brooke's vlog. Catch you guys later. Guys, it feels amazing outside. It's just mm, like it's fresh, windy, but not too cold. And then it's really beautiful outside. The sun is shining, the sky is blue. Yeah, I just, I just had to come outside and just enjoy the outdoors a little bit. I'm going to play with Baby for a bit. And yeah, it feels amazing, guys. It was the next day and as you can see my face is crazy because I got a chemical peel done. I will for sure have a video for you all. And I just want to come back here to end up the vlog. Um, I'm hungry so I am just eating some hummus with some pita chips. And just some leftovers that I had from yesterday. Fish, shrimp, and dirty rice. I'm just going to end up the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed just a little bit of what I do during the week. And if you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel for more videos, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!